glad to have you guys back on the channel welcome to football house stories uh things are beginning to turn around for good for chelsea uh it started with the win against Tottenham Hotspur, the 4-1 thrashing of Tottenham Hotspur. And now we are receiving news that Christopher Nkunku is back. It's not that he's almost back or that he's still uh, he's still limping or he's still nursing injury. No. Nkunku is back. He is back right now. Uh, if you've kept close eye on Chelsea's training at uh, the Cobham, you would realize that he has been a consistent uh member uh in that cobham training ground he has been training throughout this week and he is fully back this is no rumor but the question is when is he going to be deployed when is he going to start making appearances for chelsea game uh is he going to be uh, available to play the man city game this sunday uh 5 30 pm that is the real question well, Chelsea has said that they, they don't want to rush Nkuku uh, to return. They want to take as much time as he needs to see that he recovers fully and that he comes back with 100% clean bill of health so that it, you know, it doesn't become a situation whereby uh, they are managing him and then he goes back for, um, for another injury that's probably even worse than the one that he had. So they are trying to uh, not rush the guy and allow him to recover fully uh, and then incorporate him into the team. So, but right now, Goku is back. Uh, the expected return date, uh, you know, based on what Chelsea Medicals uh, have always maintained, uh, had always been late November slash early December. And we are just close to the middle of november but the guy is already back of course what the medical uh, the dates that medicals do set is not like specific day it's like uh, estimated time of recovery so but right now kuku is back and he is uh, training with the guys you know just like these pictures i've been uh, putting on this on this video indicate so that's the news guys goku is back but he is not going to make the um Man City game because uh, he doesn't. They can't. They don't want to rush him. Uh, Pochettino himself doesn't want to rush him. He values Nkuku very much, and he sees him as a long-term imp uh, uh, improvement uh, on the Chelsea attack. So he wants to, according to what's coming out right now, according to the gossip from Cobham, Nkuku is not going to make a return until after the international break. And uh, remember the international break. Uh, uh, takes place immediately after this weekend's fixture so anything from next week all right will be international break so after the international break that's when Okuku is reportedly expected to make his return that's it on the Goku front but it's all good vibes all joy you know seeing the guy in training and as he interact with his teammates and all of that remember he's always been very supportive to his teammates on social media every time Jesse play a match he wishes them well if they win a match he shows support by posting the match and all of that if they lose he also shows support you know by also posting as well so he's he's not been around but he's kind of been around you know so that's the that's that's the good thing about this Chelsea team they are very uh they are they are they are very compact they you know they show care for themselves they, they are you know, really uh, enjoying and blending well together as a as a team, as a unit. Uh, so, guys, on another update. Uh, this one is concerning Romeo Lavia. You know, we've been seeing a series of updates from Romeo Lavia. Of course, his return date was also speculated to be December, to be the same time as Okoku. But I, there's nothing for sure right now uh, as regards whether he has uh, been integrated into the Cobham training. Because we've not really seen pictures of him or you know any videos of him training with the guys but let's we'll still keep our fingers crossed on that one uh then about uh firstly for fana man that guy's injury is just something else i don't know whether he's having a relapse or he's having a setback or something like that but if you see the kinds of pictures that he, do, he does post on his instagram you would know that he probably is not in the right 
frame of mind like it just it he posts sad pictures to be honest and it you know when someone posts pictures like that then it just it tells you that their return date is probably not very close what was the final of course you know will be out of the season so his recovery should be next year anything next year after the season and may or june or something like that but that's the update guys and cuckoo coming back to chelsea being a good uh, a huge boost for the, for the chelsea side at the time that you know he is much needed now chelsea are starting to get the stride are getting starting to get the groove on and Okuku coming you know into that attack will obviously improve chelsea even more thank you for watching the video uh subscribe to the channel if you've not done so already and stay tuned for more uh more videos